If you like fishing, talk about fishing. If you like children, talk about the rights of children. If you like fashion, do a blog about fashion. Talk about what you like or what you know. It's not, you know, nobody has to open a blog on human rights because if you're not you know if you don't have anything to illustrate it it's going to be boring for you so you're not going to keep it up after six months you let it drop let's say you're a woman and you truly love fashion so blog about fashion because blogging about fashion you're going to meet very quickly online other people who love fashion and they'll leave comments and they'll make suggestions and they may have patterns you know to how to do things for cheap for yourself and this is going to create your own little community your group of friends and this is the power of social media is getting to know people online that you would never have the opportunity to meet in real life and to talk about things you love it's driven by passion and love so once you're going to have a maybe next year you'll get through with fashion and you start talking about I don't know something that is not quite right in your family or not quite right in your school not quite right at university and little by little your world will become bigger and your world become larger and you'll suddenly realize that on some problems you are not alone that many other women or many other men share exactly the same concern and are looking for solutions so instead of staying all as you know all alone in your room why don't you go out and venture in the world even if it's with fashion or a blog about I don't know films a blog about Pakistanis pop music from the 90s who cares it's about you know talking about your like I hope Global Voices will remain uh, this wonder this absolute marvel it has been that is a community blogs are people right behind every blog there's people so if you've got a platform about blogs you've got a platform of people and i do hope and i cross fingers that global voice will keep this uh, wonderful spirit of just you know um, mixing people who are interested by the same topics and interested about talking about what is happening in their place um, to other people in the world and I think it is absolutely wonderful that Global Voice, uh, it's a true miracle that people from in Bolivia talk about issues that get people from Bangladesh interested in them. And sometimes people from Africa talk about things that really interest Chinese readers. So this crisscrossing the world is uh, just knitting a new network uh, over the borders. And for the time being, I just, you know, I'd like, I think it's wonderful. I want it to remain the same.